Hello everyone, thank you for checking out this video. You are with Coach Joel from Terry Chew Academy. Right now, we are going to solve this question together. For this lesson, we will be tackling another question on logic. Okay, so let's get to the question. So the question mentioned that a chess club has a one-on-one -on -one knockout tournament Okay, where ev anyone who is defeated in any match is eliminated. Okay, so let's we need to know that. Okay, so the tournament will last until that until there is a winner, and if there are thirty two players that entered, okay, how many matches will be played all together before a winner is decided? Okay, so we first know that they are playing one on one okay which means to say that every two players will be in a match with each other okay so if there are 32 players entering the tournament okay so let's think about it this way okay let's think about it in terms of rounds okay so in the first round actually how many games will be played okay it isn't 32 games it is actually 32 divided by 2 which is equals to 16 matches, okay? 16 games, okay? So why is that so? Because each match will consist of two players, okay? That's why we can simply take our number of players, divide by two, to find that we have a total of 16 matches, okay? So after these 16 matches, what actually happens is that 16 people will be eliminated, right okay so because that's the format of this tournament they will be eliminated okay which means to say that i should have now 16 people remaining okay 16 players remaining okay so in my second round okay if i know that there are 16 players remaining okay so in my second round Okay, all I need to do is simply to take 16, which is the number of players that I have now, divide by 2, and I will get 8 matches now. Okay, so because I am left with 16 players, all I need to have is just 8 matches. And what will actually happen is that after these 8 matches, okay, of course I must have 8 victorious winners from these eight matches right which means to say that my remaining number of players must be eight okay which means that i can actually move on to the third round okay because a winner haven't been decided yet okay so you notice that in the third round now because i have eight players remaining i simply need to take eight divide by two again to get four matches okay once more i'm gonna mention again if i only have eight players all i need is four matches okay because like i said earlier they are in a one-to-one -one tournament which means that every match will consist of only two players okay so what happens after the third round okay there will be four matches played which means to say that once again there will be four winners from these four matches, okay? So a winner, the ultimate winner haven't been decided yet, okay? But we know that there are four of, we, four of these winner from these four matches. So we can actually move on to the fourth round now, okay? Sorry, okay? So in the fourth round, because there are four players only, we do not need four games. We simply need 4 divided by 2, which is 2 matches, okay, or 2 games, okay. So, we only need 2 matches, okay, and once again, you will notice that in these 2 matches, okay, the winner of each match will actually compete to determine who is actually the winner overall, okay. So, we actually has, have one last round, which is the final round. Okay, which is these two players, I divide by two of them, I should have only one more match, which will determine 
my winner overall okay so therefore from here we can find the total number of matches played okay so total matches played will simply be equals to adding up the first round second round third round fourth round as well as the final round okay in which i have circled it okay which means this is simply 16 plus 8 plus 4 plus 2 plus 1 okay and when you add all of them up you will get an answer of 31 which is your final answer thank you for watching this video i hope you have enjoyed today's lesson goodbye and see you again in another lesson if you would like to learn more from these tutorials, please smash that like and subscribe button.